Good day, Grade Elevens. We proceed with Things Fall Apart by Chinua Achebe. Okay, um, just a little bit of recap into the previous chapter, chapter 11. We see the priestess Chielo coming over to a concourse compound and um, demanding that Agbala, or the prophet of the hills and the caves, would like to see his daughter Yazinma. Now, as much as Okonko tries to um, protest and negotiate that she comes back in the morning, he is unsuccessful. And he's warned that um, if not against Agbala. So he allows Chielo to take Zenma. And um, we see Okonko displaying a great deal of emotion. And he does not want the Zenma to be taken that night. And um, even when she's taken, he makes a trip four times to the shrine to await the priestess and the Zenma. And it is only on the fourth visit that he sees his wife, Ikwefi, there at the mouth of the, of the cave. Again, we see Ikwefi. Um, she defies her husband's instruction for the first time to return home while he waits for their daughter. They find without any consequence. Now, as chapter 12 begins, um, is a new day, and Okonko's um, friend, Obierika, is celebrating his daughter's Uri. Uri is a wedding ceremony, and um, the suitor, on top of the greater price, uh, sorry, part of the bride price that he has paid before, he'll be bringing in more palm wine. To what they refer to as the Umna. Um, this is a large group of male relatives that will be coming in to celebrate together with with Obierika. Now we are told in this chapter that the priestess, Yellow, had crawled out of the shrine. She did not even care to look at Okonko and Ikwefi in the eyes. Um, but she returns the Zenma back to Okonko's compound with the two parents following behind. Um, we see the family is coming together. Okonko's family um, goes to assist Abierika's wife. Um, they take with them some food and water. Now, Noe's mother takes her four children. And Ojiugo takes her two children, and Ikwefi will follow later with Ezinma. But remember that they had a um, late night due to the priestess's visit. So they also send word with um, Noe's mother to tell Obierika's wife that they would be a little late, uh, but would soon join them. Now at the ceremony, food is prepared. There is a bit of a distance. Um, when women discover that one of Ezelagbo's um, husband's cows has been let loose onto a neighbor's crops by one of the children, and according to custom, a heavy fine is um, imposed on the owners of, of the cow. Um, with that incident lapsing, we have the first pot of palm wine arriving from the in-laws. And then we see Obierika's relatives and friends arriving. Um, they count all in all 50 pots of palm wine that are presented to Obierika's family, much to the appreciation and approval of, of um, the males. 
of the people that are gathered there. And then we see proceedings are done according to custom and feasting follows into the late evening. Now, what Achebe is exposing to us in this chapter is um, that marriage rituals in this society and how the families came together to support one another. Now, just like the European societies, we are shown by Achebe that the African societies also had structured customs as well. They had their way of doing things before the advent of Western influence.